When attempts to put a chairlift on Mount Rainier failed, a group of dedicated skiers got together and began looking for another spot. Yeah, I'm here, and I'm checking out Crystal Mountain Ski Area. It's summertime. Crystal Mountain Ski Resort is just six miles from the northeast entrance of Mount Rainier National Park. The skiers decided on Crystal Mountain for its reliable snowfall and variety of terrain. I made it up, it's time to go check in. Staying at Crystal Mountain Hotels. Summertime, people come to ski resorts in the summertime? We are all about summer fun here at Crystal Mountain. December 8th in 1962 marked the opening day of Crystal Mountain. In 1964, the Silver Ski Chalet was open, the Alpine Inn and the Snorting Elk still serving beautiful dinners. The Summit House was opened as well. I'm visiting Crystal Mountain in Washington. What do you do at a ski resort in the summertime? Let me tell you, there's quite a lot. Come with me and I'll show ya. So we're gonna do yoga class, but it's a little bit misty to do yoga class in the meadow, so we're doing it in the chapel. In 1966, in the summertime, the chapel was built for community gatherings. Hi, family! Hey! How's it going? <laughs> you gonna go ride the gondola? Uh, so yeah, we come up here with a bunch of friends and like there's always kids running around, so cool. they have plenty to do. Hey, ski mom, ski dad. <laughs> ski dad. <laughs> have fun. I'm riding the Mount Rainier Gondola, a year-round tram from base to summit. So different than wintertime when I have my skis, I don't have to do anything but just climb aboard. In 1955, the group proposed to the National Forest Service that Crystal Mountain become a winter sports recreation area. Funding of the initial development was raised by the sale of stock to approximately 200 people. Wildflowers, wildflowers everywhere. I love the wildflowers, put them in your hair. Da, 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 da. Ski Mom here with Steve, and you do the interpretive walks. I do the interpretive walks. We talk about the geology, the um, trees, the plants, the animals, everything that's kind of native to this area. It's a lot of fun. Excellent. Amazing. Place. Lots of flowers. Not just for skiing in the winter, Crystal Mountain hosts many weekend events bringing live music. Here I'm going to check out the 10th annual wine festival. Oh, wineries from Washington, and maybe I can share my tickets and make some friends. gold were found in them there hills. In the late 1800s and prospectors flocked to the area, originally known as the Summit Mining District. After World War I, mining activity declined because there wasn't much available. It wasn't until 1949 that the recreational opportunities were discovered. Like many ski resorts, Crystal Mountain offers a place for families and friends to get together and enjoy some time. That Seuss machine down there, got rocks in here, you can go and find yourself some gemstones. Cool. Yeah. Okay, so how's it? It's like a bag and you buy it? Yeah. It's like one of these. Okay. You can go down there, sift it out, find yourself some sweet rocks. Okay, yeah. so you did the mining and these are your jewels? Yeah. Let's see. Horseback riding is definitely a great thing to take part in in the mountains. There's quite a beautiful stable of horses you can see here at Crystal Mountain. A wide variety of activities like yoga, live music, an 18-hole disc golf course that spans the mountain from top to bottom. It's easy to keep yourself entertained in the mountains. Ski resorts in the summertime. Ski resorts all year round. Get out there. Ski them. Out. Stay tuned for long format half-hour episodes coming soon.